There's nothing like chilling with my girls Just me and my divas taking over the world What's up, love? So it's your girl, and this video is going to be of me styling this unit that I created using hair from Queen Life Hair. Yes, you guys, I did write that on the inside of the cap. That's the way I know which wig this is. I did sew some combs in this, and I did put in an elastic band. They did send me their Brazilian version water wave hair in the lengths of 22, 22, 20, and an 18 inch frontal. I think there was either three or four bundles, but either way, I did use three and the hair is super long but let me tell you guys about this front so as you guys see it is parting really nicely it looks so natural so when i first bleached the knot okay i left it on for 30 minutes with 30 developer and you know just regular bleach and the knots did not lift after 30 minutes so i had did this one along with another unit so then i was just like oh my gosh after i went ahead and rinsed the bleach out so right after I rinsed it out I went ahead and just re-bleached it while the hair was wet so hunties once I went ahead and re-bleached it and I left it on there for like another 25 minutes the knots lifted so nicely the hair did not shed it did not get brassy like amazing so this frontal is really like a one in my book like this is a really really good frontal I love when they just don't shed and stuff like that that means that they're really worth it so as you guys see I'm just gonna go ahead and customize this to my head and I'm just gonna cut off some of the excess lace on the sides because you know these lace frontals they aren't made for just like you in particular they're universal sizes so you're definitely gonna have to customize it so that's what I'm doing here. Now I did sew this on a spandex dome cap and for some reason this one fits like amazing. Like it really fits great. The elastic band helps it. I only put like the combs in the back. I didn't put any combs at the temple or anything because you know I'm trying to grow out my edges. Plus I really don't think you need them especially if you're going to like either mousse it down, hairspray it down, gel it down, glue it down. Whatever preference is yours it's up to you how you want to do it. But you will need some baby hairs. I mean well you won't but me. I like some so that's what I'm gonna create now so the hair for one is really nice hair it washes easy you know I love a good wavy style especially if it really waves up then you don't have to do anything at all but the one thing that I was really really pleased with was the front so like I had bleached another one at the same time and to me that one shed like and it lifted super fast but this one no ma'am it gave me no issues at all and honestly this is not the first time that I've had to re-bleach a frontal or a closure um, and it just seems like they work really really good when they're wet so I mean I might have to just start you know spritzing some water on them from time to time and then bleaching them because it seems like it just lifts the hair a lot better so now you guys know the oldie but goodie it's not really old but this is my favorite mousse in the whole world yes honeys available at the Dollar Tree for a dollar make me holla I love this mousse I have probably like eight cans of it I will never run low on stock um, I used to be like an Aussie instant freeze girl mousse type of girl but that stuff is like four bucks and then I even tried herbal essence that's almost four bucks they all work the same so why not just get yourself a dollar can this handy dandy tool that I'm using is an eyebrow trimmer and I also did get that at my local Dollar Tree as well they do come in a three pack so I'm going to use this just to form me some baby hairs trust me what I'm telling you I'm not going to be using all of the hairs that I cut out but you know from time to time I might switch it up so I just got me some baby hairs already ready to go ready to go now, I do like to keep the ones on the side like close to my ear a little bit longer that just helps the wig lay in place a little bit more for me um, and that's just what I do but like I said everybody has their own preference it's up to you how you want to do your lace front wig 
but like I said the hair is nice it just shed a little bit once I washed it not the frontal but the actual bundles and I did use all the bundles I'm not really sure if they sent me three or four they probably sent me three bundles because you really only need like three when you're doing a frontal um, but it's up to you you can always double the tracks but this one I only used three and I love the cap like this cap is not like the average cap it's a little bit smaller these ones seem to run smaller which are really great for making wigs so now what I did is I did use my pump it up hairspray which is great for holding down your wigs for like a day or two or three and then you just tie a scarf around it like so and then you just apply some heat to it honestly I don't even do it like this anymore with the curling barrel because it started getting really hot on my scalp and I mean listen I'm not trying to really lose any skin any brain cells so I actually do it with my blow dryer now and I will have a video of me using the blow dryer how I use my blow dryer to apply my wigs in about a week or so so just stay tuned for that but in the meantime in between time I'm just gonna go ahead and saturate the hair or not really saturate it but wet it up a bit so that way the waves really start to pop this is just conditioner and water in this bottle right here um the conditioner i actually did get from a young lady who i did a video on her conditioner is really really great and i did throw in some dove conditioner up in there too like i do like dove conditioner as well so the back portion of the hair i'm going to end up blow not blow drying it but curling it but we'll see how that turns out hunties so i'm just gonna take off this scarf right now and let's see how it comes out this was definitely like you know probably like 30 minutes later you know because i did go outside and get mumsy from school so kind of like air dried a little bit you can tell from the curls it's a little bit dry so i did you know walk around the house and kind of let it air dry out now i didn't really know which side i wanted to part on but normally when i do a part on one side and if i flip it over on the opposite side the volume in the front is like amaze balls like for real if you only want some volume if you want some volume up in your hair girls definitely part it on one side and then flip it over to the opposite side you will have all the volume you need like seriously your hair will be heightened to the teeth so as you guys see the hair is really cute it's very wavy super long you know what i mean very summer like you could put on a maxi dress with this and look really really cute girl okay like look i'm saying are you slaying i do like the sideburns not the sideburns but the baby hairs and i'm saying do you see the parting in this like did i do a good job or what i'm just saying like i'm really really tickled pink that this frontal came out really really nice so queen life hair queen life like seriously girl they got some really nice hair i'm very shocked at the quality the prices are super affordable now i'm gonna go ahead and just you know press the front of my hair just to lay it flatter and also it will hike up a little bit of volume i know you guys you did see me kind of like scorch my scalp a little bit you know hey that's what happens when you're trying to do your hair but do you see how well the hair lays now keep in mind the frontal did not come like this meaning i had to pre-cluck it tweeze it you know thin it out in the front just to make it look a little bit more natural but you know it was so worth it um, now I'm just going to be curling it I'm just going to curl the back some where I didn't wet it because I just didn't want to wet too much but I should have but I'm just gonna take this really really tiny barrel curler which is from the irresistible me wand collection you guys know how much I rave about that wand that I'm always using well that's the smallest one in the barrel and I absolutely love it. It's great for giving yourself like little beachy waves. So don't you think this hair came out cute? You could definitely dye it, bleach it, do what you want with it. But I think like Queen Life has some really nice hair. I'll definitely keep you guys posted on this. I will be doing an update soon. But I think it's gorgeous. You can check the description box out for all the details. Let me know what you think. I love you guys. Stay diva and delicious. I'll see you guys in a soon to come video. And bye.